so will Australia though. Australia with three changes, bringing in Jones, Shipper and Linton. Women's medley relay. Australia and United States resume their rivalry. Russia in one, Germany two, Japan, United States, Australia, China, Sweden and Great Britain. Backstroke, then the breaststrokers, then the butterflies, the freestylers. It's Coughlin for the United States and Seabone of Australia. Reiko Nakamura, Japan and Longsi of China. Natalie Coughlin got away to a great start. That's what we expect of her. She's very powerful on the start and the turn. She'll be up at the 15 metre mark. She's certainly got three quarters of body length out there for the United States. Everyone has to try and catch them now. Great start by Coughlin for the USA. Nakamura going well there for Japan, giving Japan a good start. And Seabone, the 14-year-old Australian, is swimming a wonderful first leg. She's almost up on level terms with the great Natalie Coughlin. It's going to be the United States and Japan and Australia not far away, under world record pace. So in they go, the breaststrokers now. It's Lisa Jones for Australia, Tara Kirk, United States, Asumi Kitagawa of Japan. Lisa Jones is absolutely powering away. The fastest breaststroke split she's ever swum in a relo is 105.51, and you can guarantee if she's got it in her, she will try and do that again tonight. Lisa Jones taking the lead for Australia, under world record pace at the 150. The United States in second place with Tara Kirk, and then it's back to Japan. Lisa Jones absolutely powering. The 50 breaststroke she had tonight was just a warm-up for this event. Jones for Australia. The United States, Russia going well down in lane one, challenging for third place with Japan. But it's the Australians and the United States at the halfway mark. The butterflies go in. Under world record pace, Australia, United States and Japan. Shipper, Commissars and Doi. The three butterflies who lead the way for Russia. Don't forget this below, but down there in one. But it's Shipper for Australia. Commissars, United States, about one and a bit body lengths behind. I think Jessica has actually increased that lead. She is trying to swim away. Look at that turn. Jess Shipper will be feeding off the noise of the crowd. She will be able to hear them on every single stroke, and that will really help her get home. Australia from the United States, under world record pace. Linton and Niemeyer, the last leg swimmers. In third place, Japan. Back there in fourth, it would be Russia. It's a fair way back to the rest of them. In they go, Australia, the United States. Half a second, under world record pace. Russia in third place, and followed by Japan. Linton, Niemeyer. Shugina is there for Russia, neither for Japan, but away goes Lenton. Lenton's got a wave following her. Her kick is so powerful. She has a habit of going out really hard. Hopefully it's not too much because Lacey Niemeyer is one of the fastest relay swimmers that we've seen here at the World Championships. Niemeyer has given Lenton a huge start though as Lenton's about to bring Australia home. It's Lenton against the world record. Linton starting to tire, but it's going to be a gold medal for Australia and looks like a world record as Linton powers home. Australia win a gold in a world record time. Australia do it. United States silver. And there's the race for the bronze medal. Fast finishing China take it. The Australians. Seabone, Jones, Shipper and Linton on top of the world. Four. <laughs> the girls look so